has been altogether too long since we've mentioned Taylor Swift and or Travis Kelsey on the show. But they're back in the news. But they're not exactly the subject of this story as much as PETA is. See, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey, of course, overseas in Australia. Taylor Swift carrying on the Australian leg for Eras Tour. And while they're one of the things they did while they're out and about together, actually multiple times it looks like, is go stop by the Sydney Zoo. And PETA is very upset about this. The organization PETA. They say, while we understand all too well the appeal of seeing Australia's wildlife, PETA hopes the next time Taylor and Travis want to see wild animals, they'll spend their time and money at a true sanctuary. This was Taylor's second trip Uh to the zoo in just a short week. She really loves it. Some people are saying in like a three-day span. Uh She went without Travis, and then she went with him. Yeah. She loves the zoo. She must have loved it so much. She saw so many things. She's like, Travis has got to see this. That's probably what she was thinking. He's got to get here. Yeah. Yeah, PETA, I mean, I'm starting to wonder if PETA knows less about animals than we do. Yeah. I'm starting to wonder. Because Tell PETA talks about how obviously they prefer them to go to an animal, animal sanctuary. Yeah. Because the visitors are not allowed to feed or touch the animals there. Uh-huh. It must keep their distance so as not to disturb them. Yeah. I have not been to the zoo in a while. Uh huh. Do you get to touch animals? Very few. Very few. I think Taylor and Travis got to feed, and this is something I would love to do. I didn't. Our our zoo doesn't do this. They got to feed the kangaroos on a private tour. How fun does that sound? Sounds incredible. Yeah, but apparently that PETA is anti feeding kangaroos. See, and I would say another reason that I don't think they know animals very well. Yeah. I'll relate it back to my dog, Jim. Mm-hmm. If a guest came over and gave Jim a little, a little snack, yeah, happy Jim. Uh-huh. If a guest came over, did not pet Jim, uh-huh. nor gave him a little snack, yeah. unhappy Jim, uh-huh. I have to think a kangaroo could be similar. Doesn't everybody love a little snack? I brought you, I brought you some donuts this morning. Yeah. Look you how like happy that? I am. Happy boy. Yeah. Yeah, and PETA talking about animal sanctuaries. I'm sure there's many animal sanctuaries that do great work, probably the majority. But I've seen, I've seen Tiger King. I know just because it's called an animal sanctuary doesn't mean that it's treating the animals all on the up and up. And just because PETA, just assuming because it's a zoo, means that it's bad, how, you're really going to take on the entire zoo industry, PETA? It's tough. It's really yeah. tough. Yeah, there's PETA's a lot PETA's always of, saying crazy things. They have a tendency to go for like the biggest, the biggest bully in the room, but when they can't even, you know, extinguish some of the, the, the smallest of animal issues. Like actual animal, like abuse, like yeah. the real serious stuff. Right. Yeah. They're attacking zoos. Zoos are a tough thing uh-huh. to take down. So, some zoos, the way they treat animals, I'm sure debatable debate. It's probably more debatable than it is clearly wrong, but yeah, there's a lot of like clearly wrong things. And PETA doesn't make a lot of headlines for those. They're just taking down the debatable stuff. The debatable at best. PETA's starting to get to NASA area. I'm wondering what the heck they're doing. (laughs) And you you think about PETA too. You want to know one of the ways you're not going to make inroads with anybody? Attacking Taylor Swift. Probably the worst person to try to uh, take down. Mm -hmm. Being upset with Taylor and Travis. And I'll tell you this much too. You should just be upset with Taylor because everybody knows Travis ain't picking where they're going. <laughs> no, not in this case for sure. Wasn't that a great riot clip? While you're here, you should watch more of our videos and subscribe so you don't miss what we do next.